Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel and in this video I'm going to demonstrate how you can install VirtualBox on Windows 10. Now VirtualBox is a type 2 hypervisor by Oracle Corporation that allows you to install and run virtual machines on your host system. It's particularly useful when you want to just try out some operating systems such as Linux, Windows and see how they can run on an actual physical machine. Now to get started with the installation, open your browser and search for VirtualBox. So as you can see in this link over here, I'm going to click on it and this will take me straight to the official Oracle VirtualBox site. So as you can see here, the latest version of VirtualBox is VirtualBox 6.1 at the time of recording this video. Now to get started, click on this link here. Now this will take you to the downloads page where you can see uh, various, various operating systems listed here. So here you have Windows hosts, all right? So if you're running on Mac, you're going to click on this link here. And if you're running on a Linux distribution, you're going to click on this link to download uh, the, the respective package. But since we are installing VirtualBox on Windows, I'm going to click on this link here. Now this is going to download the executable file. And as you can see here, the download is underway. However, I already have the download already. So now I'm going to cancel this out and I'm going to head over to where I've saved the download. So here you can see I have the VirtualBox 6.1 executable file. Now to commence or begin the installation, I'm going to double click on this. All right, so on the user account control, I'm going to click yes. So the wizard pops up as you can see now to proceed, just click next. All right. So on this section here, you can see the default location is already uh, displayed here. Now, it's always advisable to leave this by default unless you have a good excuse to. Otherwise, click on next. All right. Now, this gives you some default options. For, for instance, um, this will create a start menu entry and create a shortcut on the desktop, create a shortcut in the quick launch bar and register file associations. So here, click next. So on this step, you'll be given a warning that the installation is going to reset your network connection and temporarily disconnect you from the network. So just click yes to proceed. All right, then on this step, Click install. Now the installation will get underway. So all you have to do is just sit back and wait for the wizard to finalize the installation. And there we go. The installation of Oracle VirtualBox is now complete. Now to finalize this or exit from this wizard, just click on finish. All right. Now Oracle VirtualBox is fully installed. All right. So here you can see this is a graphical user interface for Oracle VirtualBox. And if you want to start creating a, a virtual machine, just click on new here. Then you can specify the name of the virtual machine. So this will be the default path of the virtual machine. So here you can select the type of virtual machine you want to create. So here you get a list of Microsoft Windows, Linux, Solaris, BSD, and so on and so forth. So here's the, here's the version, all right, and so on and so forth. So 
That was just a brief overview of how you can install Oracle VirtualBox on Windows 10. If you found this video useful, please leave a like and subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video.